What's going on, fellow humans and resellers? It's his eye, James. 22 years selling full-time on eBay. And welcome, welcome to Glitch Fest 2024. So, eBay overnight. Boom, boom, boom. Shut down again. Let's see. Everything shut off at 11.30. Had a sale in the 12 o'clock hour, the 4 o'clock hour, and still nothing. So we are getting ready. It's a little after 10 a.m. So we're, what, hitting 11 hours with two sales so far. Another shutdown, but don't surprise me because the site is just glitchy as hell. It's a pain. It's more of a pain to get down, get around the last three days than it was like last week. I mean, it's just a mess. I should just write down all the crap that happens, but... So we are at uh, a little after 10 a.m. I'm at $19. Yesterday I was almost what? I had 200 and... No, that was that. I'm thinking the 5x5. Five five. No, I had a decent amount in the beginning, didn't I? Yeah, because I had that cassette, so. But this is the lowest it's been in quite a while at 10 a.m. But yesterday did make it up to seven hundred and nine dollars. So could have been more if it wouldn't have shut off. They didn't have to do freaking maintenance every night. Ah, uh, and being I'm not showing it's even back online yet. <laughs> uh, I have no idea how today will respond. But at least yesterday's response was good, so we'll live on that point. <laughs> so $709 yesterday. 37 items sold, 12 organic, 25 promoted. And this morning I do have another media lot, so that's a good thing. Closer look at my sales this month. So fourteen thousand nine hundred sixty-four dollars, down seventeen percent. Net sales eight thousand thirty-four dollars, up sixteen percent. What is today? Wednesday. Yeah. At least we're going in the right direction. So I'm not gonna put too much concern into it right now. Got one posh sale and the rest eBay. Questions and comments? Dun, 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 dun. I make no sales on eBay, maybe three a month. Mm. That sounds like you need to maybe list some more items. List, list, list. I have been on, I have been with eBay 15 years on and off. I do not like promoted feature at all. Yeah, but you got to use it if you're going to uh, get better sales. Uh, I wanted to test it out, so I placed a clothing item up. I set the promoted percentage. However, I forgot I listed the clothes with free shipping. No, free shipping bad. Why did I do free shipping and promoted? Well, it doesn't matter if you do them both. It's the pricing is what matters. If you change that over to free shipping, you should have upped your the price of your item I walked away with nothing can someone please please tell me what to do uh, list items don't do free shipping <laughs> and if you do list the item higher and uh, 
list a lot more items, I would say, too. Uh, and use Promote It to get the sales. How are sellers making any profit? So many sellers on eBay have free shipping. I'm, I'm taking it you're just kind of like a, a novice or maybe a part-time uh, seller. Yeah, um, I would suggest just watching videos, you know. There's a whole lot of content out there to watch. Uh, and basically start from ground zero and start learning from the ground up about everything. That's what I would do if I were you in that position. If you, you know, you, you, there's a lot of details. Like, don't do free shipping if you're going to do free returns. So there's there's a lot to learn. If yeah, you're 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 at the the ground level, so just start taking in content, taking in information, taking in knowledge. That's where you got to start. Uh, I'm just wondering, do they have the technology to target individual users with glitches? Probably said. Are they beyond doing that? Probably not said. Would they do that to users who complain all the time? Possibly. I don't know. I think they learned their lesson with that million dollar lawsuit going after somebody. So I don't think they would. Because especially with technology these days, it's too easy to get caught doing that kind of stuff. I think they've learned their lessons. Instead of being uh, getting offended when they're criticized, taking it as constructive criticism and being better. That's what. Well, okay, I know that's probably you. I probably got a good chuckle out of you there, but that's the way they should work. How about that? Some people are just nasty because they are miserable. Criticize my inventory, but not. A innocent life that I'm helping how disgusting I hope that person doesn't have children or pets you motivate me to continue trying to save stray or lost pets and saving cool things from landfills regardless of the strange looks from neighbors or low profit I'm not sure what's going on here I'm guessing you got attacked by somebody trolls are great uh, you're unbothered and they help the algorithm. When I see your video titles, I expect the opposite and giggle inside. Thanks for sharing and continued blessings to you and your family. <laughs> That's why I kind of, I, I know that you guys know that my titles are just going to be me playing around or goofing around or trying different things. So you know what you're getting with these everyday videos. So I don't worry that I'm going to offend anybody who actually watches my videos with whatever I'm putting on the title to see how the algorithm plays that being said how did the one do yesterday uh, pretty good actually for mine 1500 that's the highest since the one I do our business how our the history of our business it was more about making the point on the thumbnail and the title as opposed to actually the content of it and actually it's kind of like a I figured it'd be kind of a aha, maybe, to some of the people who do do that, seeing my title and then watch my whole video and never hear me talk about it. You know, I, I'm like, aha, got you type of thing, but yet maybe it would make them go, huh, I wonder if he's talking about me. <laughs> maybe I should stop being a butthead. <laughs> I was just wondering, do they, oh, I already read that one, let's see. I just subscribed 30 minutes ago. Well, welcome. Thank you. Thankful for that. But now I remember seeing you on a Zoom call with Daily Refinements, I believe. No. No, 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 no. Don't you ever put those words in my... Oh. <laughs> I know I've seen you in this room before. No. No, 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 no. Thanks so much for the amazing advice so far. No, 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 no. 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 <laughs> Don't put those words and my face in the same category. Please, no. Uh, 
My days are usually good, almost one sale per hour all day. The weird thing is that the items selling are the higher dollar items that were in my store for months. Stuff that I was wondering if the listing disappeared or something. Yeah, I will get bunches like, and I'm getting, they're either coincidences or they're not, where all of a sudden I'll get several items that were older sell all together, or I'll get several clothing items all together, or so media or a day without hats. I've got one hat today, but uh, yesterday was no CDs and cassettes. So a lot of that's probably coincidence, but you never know. Paul me for your legal representation. <laughs> I'm getting old. I took a step and tore and pulled every muscle around my right knee. It hurts still, but when it first happened, it hurt so bad I thought I was going to pass out. Eww. Yeah, that's not good. I still do my daily exercises where I'm on one foot. Making sure all those muscles stay nice and strong as I get older. P sounds like Pee Wee. Just a thought. All right, we're kind of caught up. So I got a Poshmark jacket sale that sold for $16. Any international? One to Canada. That's it. So I'll be surprised if we get any cha-chings during this video being that my last sale was over five hours ago. So we're on 11 hours of nothing, or of two, I should say, sorry. We'll do this posh first. We've got St. Louis Billikens jacket. That sold for 16. First up, we got Guns N' Roses t-shirt. That sold for $13.50, headed to Dickerson, Texas, Texas, Texas. Cause I'm blind in Texas. Uh, don't have many orders here. And we got two promos. The CDs that we did sell are two promo singles. So still, at least this, these kind of weird things happen. So. Odds someone who's cool so for nine bucks headed to rochester hills michigan i'm curious to see how today's going to play out being it's been such a huge seemingly shut down overnight um i predict It, there's going to be no middle ground today. It's just going to be like a $250, $300 day, or it's going to be a $700 plus dollar day. I got a feeling it's, there's not going to be no middle ground. It's going to be totally crappy, or it's going to just explode like crazy. 
being down so long. We'll see. All right, Brian Highland cassette. I'm gonna look and see. I just need to. Some things are spilt out. More upstairs I need to bring down. I'm gonna check to see if the down detector is detected because that's. Pretty uh, substantial nothingness. Mm. Right. right now, the baseline's up around 10. Usually hangs around about 1, 1 to 3. So for the last hour, you know, the last half hour, it's been 9 and 10. Uh, who knows? Who cares? Whatever. It's going to be what it's going to be. Going to be what it's going to be. So, so for six bucks, headed to Seattle, Washington. So I took the rest of the paperwork for Pee Wee over to the vet. And I sent him an email, but he's not responding to my emails. So, I think Jan's going to call him before she goes to work. Uh, caring, laugh and learn life skills cassette tape. So for seven bucks, headed to Barnett, Missouri. Next up, we've got, are you ready for a cassette light? Yeah. We got all Billy Joe cassettes mixed with one Black Sabbath. So these were all going to be lower dollar items except for the Sabbath. So let's see what we did on those with the... Twenty one ninety eight. Six of them. upstairs and grab my other ones. These are all bigger ones. It's a lot of dirt in here. Alright, I gotta run up and grab my little pads off my desk.
So if anybody's wondering what's going on, when I list cassettes, I look to see if the pad's missing or loose. If it's loose, I put them in a little tray so that when they sell and they're missing a pad, I can glue one back on. Just call me Dr. House. Sit. How dare you? Yeah, the reason that I fit in there. Still have not pulled my smaller ones out from behind everything yet. boxes behind everything. Minus 413 equals divided by 6. So it's $3 a tape for uh, a lot of the lower dollar stuff. That's perfect. Send that. So it looks like that's going to be something I'll be able to keep and be happy with the results. Next up, Howie Day promo CD single. Sold for $22.50, headed to Chicopee, Virginia. And then the last US one, we got a Miller Lite hat. Sold for 12 bucks, headed to Georgia. Warner Robins, Georgia. Hopefully he'll want to bring Pee Wee up tomorrow. That'd be awesome. eBay, you're being very, very quiet. I don't like that. Okay. 
ganda. You. Roger. And Trudy. guess they didn't print a label last night uh, so that was another glitch i guess the scan form did not print last night i don't know for for there to be as many glitches as there was in the website and the fact that i still had a 700 dollar day that's at least a positive so If last night was a total shutdown where everything's going to have to re-index again today, that's going to stink. Uh, Arrow Soka Dance Party cassette. Sold for six bucks. Headed up to Canada. Yes, it was like 83, 84. It's 31 out there and windy right now. Ouch. Figured the warm wasn't going to last. All right. Three labels, three international yesterday. And then one this morning. All right. Then we're done already. So another 30-minute video. You ready, baby girl? She's like, yes, I am. Stretch them. Oh. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm going to get back to listing and drafting. And hopefully today's sales will pick up. Anything click while I was upstairs? What you change? Nope. We're at 10.30 a.m., $19. Still nothing. So we are technically 11 hours in with two sales. Not good, eBay. Not good. You're grounded. Right? They're fired. Yes, they are. <laughs> all right. Uh, thanks, everybody. We'll see you all in the next video. Later.